healthcare workers that wear over the ear masks, their ears eventually start to hurt. That's where these come in. These are ear savers. They, they go around the uh, back of your head and, uh, uh, and you hook the string from the mask on them so it doesn't hurt your ears. In today's episode, we're going to make ear savers. Let's get started. The first thing you do is go to Thingverse. Okay, this is the ear saver, and it's by Sniffle. So you download the ear saver. I'm going to show you the best way to print it in Kira. The first thing you have to do is you have to set your layer height to 0 0.3. The next thing you want to do is set your wall thickness 3 millimeters or higher. See, if you set it to uh, 3, it's all walls. Like, it's all straight lines. But if you set it to 1, it's, a, it's all like, instead of straight lines, it's all like, the printer will just be like doing this and like shaking the whole bed. If you have straight lines, it won't do. It won't happen. If you print like this, it'll print way faster and be stronger. Okay, you have to go all the way to the bottom. And instead of that, all at a time. I mean, all at once. You print one at a time. So what that does. So like, if a print fails, it it will print like one at a time. So if a print fails, it won't mess up on all all five of them. And also, the print head doesn't have to move as far, so it doesn't take as long. See, it stays in the, on the same one, and then when it's done with that one, it just moves on to the second one. So if the print fails, you'll still have the ones you printed. I have four 3D printers printing ear savers. But th and that one's not working right now, so hopefully I can get that up and running soon. So now I'm going to make another batch of ear savers on the Prusa printer. Okay, I'm going to start the time lapse. See you later. Last night, my dad stayed up late, but maybe he stayed up a little too late. See, this ear save is there, ear save is there, and right here, it's a bunny. The bunny stamp was for my last video. So, when you're printing, make sure to choose the right file, especially when you're about to go to bed. So don't tell Ethan, but that's not the first time this happened. <laughs> One of our batches is finished. Now I'm going to unload the ear savers. Now I'm doing the sterilization. Part so, uh, we have one. I have one gallon of hot water. I mean warm water, and we have bleach crystals. The reason it's warm is so the bleach crystals can dissolve faster. But we don't want it too hot, or it'll melt the ear savers. Because we're using bleach crystals, I have to put on the safety glasses. So I need two tablespoons for one gallon of water. But see, it doesn't fit in here. So instead I'm gonna use the one teaspoon and I'm good since there's three teaspoons and one tablespoon, I'm going to have to do the uh, do the six times. Make sure it's level. Yep. 
Now I'm gonna use, now I'm gonna stir it so the chlor the bleach crystals are a little bit more dissolved. Now that the crystals are mostly dissolved, I can put the ear savers in the wash. There wasn't quite enough bleach water in there, so I had to fill it up more. But, but they don't float, so all we had to do was cover them with the bleach water. Now I need to sterilize them by keeping them in the water for 30 more minutes. For keeping the germs off the ear saver so they're sterile, make sure to wear a mask and one glove. So now I'm going to grab the ear savers, I'm going to let them drip, drip, drip dry, and then after it's done, after a few seconds, I'm going to put them in a food dehydrator to let them dry. I'm going to put the lid on the food dehydrator now. Turn it on. One more thing, we'll put the lid on this because I can reuse it. I put the food dehydrator on low so the ear savers don't melt. It's going to take 30 minutes to an hour. The first thing you're going to do is you want to clean your work area. The second step is to put your gloves on. Then you should sanitize your gloves. These are one ounce popcorn bags. We put 10 ear savers in each bag. So it lasts one week for healthcare workers. We're assuming they're gonna throw them away at the end of their shift. Let's get started. I put the ear savers in and I put a label on the box that says ear savers and I post it on social media that anyone who wants ear savers can pick them up. For a one kilogram spool of filament you can make 500 ear savers. I'm happy that health care workers try to keep us safe and I hope their ears won't hurt as much. Please like and subscribe. Bye.